It was probably the most fear I've ever had in my life. A call to Ben PD's non-emergency dispatch at 1.15 on Thursday. An unknown person claiming to have weapons in their car in the parking lot at Bend High. We had a school resource officer who was on campus at the time. That officer place the school immediately into secure, which means nobody comes in, nobody goes out. Police arrived just a few minutes later. Students were kept in classrooms for around an hour, along with those at every other high school in the district. The first thing I did was right when I got into that classroom, I decided to just be aware and just in case something happened, I looked at all the hiding spots there. They just kind of told us to like stay calm and that nothing huge was happening. Police searched the grounds and even used drones for a bird's eye view, but couldn't find any weapons or suspects. At 1.40, the school district sent out text messages to parents about the threat. Ben City Councilor Anthony Broadman was among them, rushing to the school to reunite with his daughter. This is part of being a kid right now, which is pretty disturbing uh, to go through these lockdowns. This is sort of the lockdown generation, my generation, my kids' generation, and it's pretty scary for them. You never want to hear this with your kid. It's Never a good situation, very concerning. Mixed emotions over a situation that could have been worse, but with no real conclusion. It's frustrating, not like to the school, like, oh, uh, why is this happening? It's more just to humanity in a way, just like, come on, guys, <laughs> let's do better. It might take a little bit to, you know, wash all of those uh, bad feelings away, but um, knowing how seriously they take it, it makes me probably feel a lot safer.